All right, I have here a new challenge lock. Hogtoberfest. Which, Hogtoberfest. So, uh, which is a dimple challenge lock. Very rare. Don't see many dimple challenge locks. Um, and not just a dimple challenge lock, but a pin and pin, like a multi lock style. Um, and of course, because it is called Hogtoberfest, I thought it would be appropriate to drink a German beer with it. So, got my favorite brewery uh, here. Let's have a glass. Right. Ah, delicious. Have some of that. Got out a um, multi pick number six. Uh, multi pick Zebra, the number eight. Mind you, they're all pretty much the same. Um, so we'll pick this way. Uh, the trouble with dimples is they do hard to not completely obscure everything. And we'll go down the right hand side here and see what we see. All right, oh, click on one. That's good. Ooh. Rotate into some good stuff there. All right, winding down here, I'm gonna click. Winding down the back. Down the rotating. Click, that one was a bit tougher. Going back, got some more binding in the middle here. And click. The front. Binding, click. Binding. Click. Alright, let's. It feels like that's the most obvious binding done. All right, what can we find? Oop. Tap something there, and we're in a little bit more of a full set. I think we're on the inner pins now. Right, here we go down the back, binding. Yep. Counter rotate and click there. It's possible I'll need to switch picks to get these in this, but usually this one works all right. So I'll keep at it, and if I can't feel anything, I'll move on to something else. And sometimes it helps to. Give a check from the other side real quick. Yep, that was a click on two. Another tiny click there. I said it feels pretty set now. Rotate and click at the back there. Lots of feedback off this lock. Alright. Oop. Big false set. That's a great sign. I we must be just about done. Alright, another one at the back there. Even deeper false set. Tap out a one, a little bit of rotation. At this point, it's usually pretty hard to stuff up on a multi lock, at least. On a challenge lock, who knows? Just gotta find that last in pin.
Oh, a tiny tap there. Gotta be close. And there we have it. Hogtoberfest. Time for another drink. Oh, that is extremely delicious. Um, all right. Let's get a pitting tray and see what is in this. Now, there is a sealed uh, disaster recovery kit and a pinning guide, um, and presumably the keys. We might try and see if we can do it safely without the key. Um, gutting tools, need a screwdriver. Try and take these out without rotating that core any. with the key. There we go. Yeah, screws out. Right, 45, that's probably a safe angle. And our follow up. I've got to say, whatever's in this, it was a fun pick, lots and lots of feedback. All right, and safe. Now it pins it this way. So there's our um, bidding. Lots of uh, lots of lift needed. I can feel there's or well, see there's um, serrations in here. Ooh, a deep uh, counter milling there. Yep. All right, let's get these out. So pin one. Torpedo two. Three. Four and five. All right, so there's a look at the core. Empty. It's a pretty good core mods look in there. That explains all the extra clicks we're getting. So everything catches. Where's my tweezers gone? Um, so we've got torpedo pin, standard inner. Lightly serrated, standard in up, standard, lightly serrated, we've got a <coughs> pin in pin key pin here. Interesting. Alright, now for the drivers, the business end. Okay. So that's a spool type. Big spring, we've got threading in the core there, or the bottle rather. We've got a, well, these are going to be hard to describe, but I'll just show you when they're all out. Uh, another spring. Standard. I got these two from the back. And this one. Ooh, that's a nice one. 
Okay, it would seem that the one, two, three, four chambers uh, are very threaded, and the back one is space. Um, there you go, you can see those threads in there. Okay, now uh, let's get a close up of these pins. So you can see we've got some nice uh, serration spool action on these. Uh, yeah, very nice. So there we go, that is Hog Turbofest. Um, with the pin in there. Well, let's just um, quickly open this up. Are there keys in here? Keys, let's, oh, they're sealed with sticky tape. Oh, we'll forget it then. Doesn't matter, I'll leave them in there. Uh, thanks for watching.